टूडे वी विल अंडरस्टैंड द क्लॉक तो वॉट इज दैट दैट इज नथिंग बट योर ट्रिग्नोमेट्रिक क्लॉक नेक्स्ट वॉट वी हैव टू डू जस्ट वी हैव टू मेक अ सर्कल नेक्स्ट डिवाइड इट इन टू फोर पार्ट तो नाउ दिस इज योर एक्स एक्सिस दिस इज योर वाई एक्सिस एक्स एक्सिस एंड दिस इज योर वाई एक्सिस नाउ अंडरस्टैंड दिस दिस फर्स्ट इज योर फर्स्ट क्वार्टर quadrant means if you divide a circle into four parts it will form here 90 degree so that's why we are saying as it's a quadrant it's a sector which forms 90 degree at the center so this is your first quadrant this is your second quadrant this is your third quadrant and this is your fourth quadrant now This is your east, है ना This is our east. तो east will start with your zero degree. तो zero degree comes here towards the this. This is your नाइंटी degree. Or we can say it's a pi by टू This is your वन एटी degree. or we can say it's pi this is your 3 pi by 2 or we can say it's 270 degree this again is 0 degree or we can say it's 360 degree or 2 pi or 2 pi now we will go for a sign first we will go for a sign to so sign when we are going for a sign we know the table normal table what we have learnt in our o level or we can say it's a 10th level so we know that sign 0 degree is 0 for sign this is 0 this part is 0 so we can say sign is zero here comes here this is sign 90 sign 90 is 1 so here we can say sign 90 degree is 1 sign 90 degree is 1 comes here 180 degree so if you go 180 degree to zero it will be zero only so here it is sin 180 degree is zero comes to 270 degree so here if you write sin 270 degree that means it's 180 degree from 90 90 it is 1 this will become minus 1 so here the value of sin is minus 1 now check it so suppose your scale is like this so here if you see the scale is like this so this is your zero this is your one and this is your minus one we know that zero to one is positive always positive and zero to minus one or minus one to zero is negative now check this if we are moving from sin 0 degree to 90 degree that means 0 to 1 it is positive therefore the first quadrant of a sign is positive so here we will write sign positive whatever value we will get we will get a positive value only no negative comes here see this sin 1 2 0 1 2 0 again it is positive so here again sign is positive 
कम्स हेयर तो यू कैन सी हेयर साइन जीरो टू माइनस वन जीरो टू माइनस वन इज नेगेटिव तो देर फोर हेयर साइन वॉट एवर वैल्यू वी विल गेट वी विल गेट इन माइनस नेगेटिव वैल्यूज नेक्स्ट कम्स हेयर तो हेयर इट इज माइनस वन टू जीरो अगेन इट इज नेगेटिव तो साइन इज नेगेटिव हेयर Now come to cos. <coughs> cos. We know that cos zero degree is one, and cos ninety degree is zero. If this is cos one at zero degree, one eighty degree will be minus one. So now cos is minus one at one eighty degree, and cos is zero again one eighty degree from top is zero only. So here it is cos zero. Now again we will write the quadrant. What is the cos positive or negative? So you can see cos is here. What the value? so you can see 1 2 0 1 2 0 is positive so cos is positive in the first quadrant comes to second one 0 2 minus 1 0 2 minus 1 it is negative so here cos is negative next comes 180 degree to 270 degree Minus one two zero minus one two zero again it is negative so here also cos is negative comes here fourth quadrant cos zero two one zero two one again it is positive so here it is cos is positive the value of cos is positive only. so here we we have written sin and cos but if we go for the tan so just what we have to do just we have to divide it put a bar that is tan so positive plus positive is always positive for the tan next comes here tan so positive by my negative is negative so tan is negative in your second quadrant comes here third quadrant is negative and negative negative divided by negative is positive so tan is positive in your third quadrant comes to your fourth negative by positive is negative so tan is negative here comes to your cot cot is reciprocal of tan so whatever the sign tan carries it will also carry by a cot also next comes your cosec cosec is reciprocal of sin so whatever value sin will contain in that quadrant cosec will also carry that that means sin is positive that means cosec is also positive here sin is positive here cosec is also positive sin is negative here cosec is also negative sin is negative here also cosec is negative next comes to your secant or sec so sec is reciprocal of cos so whatever the sign positive or negative will carry by a cos it also carry by a secant so now you can see cos is positive that means secant is positive cos is negative that means secant is negative cos is negative secant is negative cos is positive secant is positive here so like this we have to do it and we will see how we can plan for that 